Well, so far the weather today has really been amazing. Little to no rain here in the area, and that has allowed crews to make significant progress since the work began last night. Caltrans says they finished work on the outside lanes early this morning and are now working on the inside lanes. They're now about 60% done and are expected to finish on time. Caltrans says it began the emergency work in mid-August to replace portions of aging concrete on the bridge deck. We have uh, a lot of contractors out here, so we're trying to accelerate the work, get them beat the weather. Um, so the weather's been cooperative so far. Now, travelers should expect just one open lane on the I-5 going northbound. Lane reductions will begin at Harbor Drive in National City and will transition to one lane before State Route 15. Some ramps will be closed. Those include westbound 94 connector, the F Street on-ramp, and the 6th Street off-ramp. The B Street on-ramp, Pershing Drive on-ramp, and the 19th Street on-ramp will be closed from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Now, back out here live, Caltrans continues to advise the public to use alternative routes to limit the impact to both crews and communities here in downtown. Back to you. So you talked about all those ramp closures and also we can see behind you the lane closures. The big question, how long is all this work going to last? Well, the work that began last night, that's expected to last until Monday 5 a.m. The whole uh, project in general is expected to be completed by end of October, early November. Live near downtown, Rocio de la Fe, CBS 8.